was your Easter, boys? Was it good? <laughs> Any Ooh, eggs? Eggs. Uh, welcome to the Underdogs podcast. Yeah. <laughs> Straight into it. No intro. Going in raw. Yeah, so you protested the intro and now here we are. So talk me through that. Well, I think our intro is too slow and too long and then we can get straight to the action. But now us introducing that there's no intro is kind of like an intro. So if you're a new listener, I apologise. Yeah, look, the intro would be playing still at the moment, but now you can hear us go like, eggs, <laughs> yeah, eggs. Easter. Easter's all right. I think it's too much chocolate. I think it's stupid. Yeah, I... Okay, your opinion changed pretty quick <laughs> within the space of a sentence, no, really. No, no, okay, I think Easter... I don't know. Cho- what's the deal with, the, like, all the chocolate? I think they Can should Can you put it that. in the form of a Seinfeld joke? Yeah. What's, what's the, the deal? deal with the chocolate? Okay, but, like, okay, how long's chocolate been a thing for oh, Easter? Oh, uh, I don't know. Yeah, that's one of the ones them chocolate companies made up. Yeah, exactly. I looked it up, there. 60s and 70s. Oh, you did it. It's so recent. And people act like it's a tradition for... No, oh, it's so you actually recent. did a bit of like research and Easter is a scam. That's what you're saying. Well, of course it's a scam. It's always a scam. But it used to be like, okay, I did some history research. Christianity is a little bit like a, like an MCN, multi-channel network thing, where they kind of take a bit, a bunch. Mm. Back in the day, there was Christianity and a bunch of other religions. And they're like, ah, we'll... Uh, We'll add your religion to our religion and come join our religion. And so there was lots of like uh, springs coming. So you have eggs and people used to just eat eggs for Easter because it's Wait, like new I'm, life. <laughs> eggs. I'm confused as to how Christianity gobbling up the other religions turned into everyone eating eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. other... Okay, okay. So <laughs> a bit like we missed a step. <laughs> okay, okay. We so missed a lot of steps. Other religions... And what eggs? Normal oh, eggs. Yeah, people just used to eat eggs. Like chicken eggs. Yeah. Right. And it was about you give each other chicken eggs because it's spring and it's new life is okay, like coming. Okay, that's cool. Are these guys aware that chickens lay eggs all through the year? <laughs> yeah, but it's <laughs> symbolising. <laughs> I said that weird. Yeah. Symbolising. And okay. then eventually Cadbury started making and selling chocolate in the 60s and 70s. Mm. As so a symbol of <laughs> the eggs. <laughs> Anyways, where was I? You tell me. I no, I think I we got there. Are. So okay. that's how we... Cadbury started making chocolate eggs because they're like, well, people were biting into hard shells and have a yolk down their yeah, face. Yeah, yeah. They were like, this is not very enjoyable. True. How long have people been cooking eggs? Well, probably a long time. Because chickens have been laying eggs for longer Yeah, but we're talking about the stoves. discovery of fire here, Jordan. That was a long time. No, but you can't just cook an egg on a fire. It's true. It's going to just... Yeah, what, you got to put an egg, on a, an egg on a fire? If you put an egg on a... You need a pan. Yeah. <laughs> I've never cooked an egg without a pan. Well, should we Google who was the first mf to cook an egg? To cook an egg, and what did they cook it on? Because you can't cook it on just a fire. It's not like a steak. Who cooked an egg first? Yeah, Christianity was gobbling up the other religions. Christmas trees, not Christian. Gobbling up fact. eggs as well. So, but wait, Chris, what What are Christmas trees then? It was from some German thing. Muslim? I oh. can't remember. No, 14th not, century. Muslims are after Christian. 14th century, they invented the pan and well, started eating eggs. Scrambled eggs have been around as early as the 14th century. <laughs> See, that's pretty recent. What about poached? When was <laughs> poached? <laughs> when was poached I forgot did, where I was going did, with this topic. Well, what did you do for Easter? Uh, well, I spent time with the family. Yeah, you're talking about how chocolate eggs are bullshit. That's how we... Oh, yeah, That's yeah, where yeah. we were getting to. I didn't realise Easter was so big, though, because now Holly works full-time. I'm, like, on the full-timer schedule. Yeah. Four days. A week. Off. Oh, yeah, yeah, Easter. Yeah. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, <laughs> wait, Monday. Wait, wait, I was going to guess Monday. <laughs> <laughs> and it's they all got big. A, they all got a thing, too. Good Friday. That's, like, the you get fish and chips. No. Oh, my God. So bad. And Jordan's <laughs> got so many opinions. <laughs> okay. He wants to get rid of the intro, and then Easter's set him off. Okay. Normally, he doesn't care about anything. Yeah, well, yeah, we went to get fish and chips, right? Do you hostile. know about this whole thing? I don't know yet. Okay, so, so the only thing that Christians keep around in Australia, and I don't know, I wish Christians were more Christian. That's what I'm trying to say. But they're like... <laughs> I don't even know what's going yeah, on. that's a call out for all the fucking Christians. <laughs> I, the, I mean, if you're a Christian and you're a really Christian, respect. But <laughs> This is like the Jordan episode. He's just going on a tear. <laughs> no, okay, okay, what okay. What do you mean? Because if you're Christian... Let him cook, I let him reckon cook. if Easter was more oh, like actual just, Easter and not we... just eating fucking chocolate it would be better. Because there there's a thing called... I'm ash. scared of you today. There's a thing called Ash Wednesday or something. Yeah. And you're supposed to fast and shit for like 40 days is up until... fast and shit? Like, <laughs> hell what? <laughs> it's like, like, you can't be shit. Shitting if you're fasting. Well, maybe like clearing everything out. That's what I thought. Anyway, you're supposed to be kind of fasting. You could do a fast shit. And no, that, like that get, it done, get it done quickly. And yeah. not eating meat on a few days leading up to Easter. And it's like this whole big thing. No, it's just fast. Good Friday because that's the day that... And um, Ash Wednesday. That they got him. 
<laughs> they got him uh, on the Friday. So you can't eat red meat, otherwise you're basically eating Jesus. I or chicken. Is the you're not supposed to eat like meat, meat because fish. you're like yeah, because Jesus is meat. But I guess Jesus wasn't a fish, so you can eat fish. But you can't eat chickens because the eggs are holy. Oh well, yes, so. yes, yes. <laughs> but yeah, you're supposed to be fasting and not eating meat leading up to Easter for like a month. Oh, and then. Well, so people, really talk that down to what it. What people do don't now? Do that. I know that's what I'm saying. What all people do nowadays is say, "Oh, Easter, I'll eat chocolate and I'll eat fish and chips on Friday," and it's just like the companies are smart because the fish and chip companies like, "Yo, well, fish I'd, and chips." It's not like you have to eat fish and chips. It's just not chicken and well, red meat. It so seems then people like people have to eat fish and chips because we went to get fish and chips because yep. Holly's family does that and. Yep. It was crazy because we. Great, thanks for the story. No, 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 is full of people. Yeah, yeah. The most people I've yeah. ever seen in a fish and chip store. And your fish and chips sitting there waiting. <laughs> yeah, we went in, went out. No, <laughs> the lady next to us said I wanted fish and chips yesterday to be picked <laughs> up at six, and I'm still here sitting here at six. People. So have been wait, so it's going to take an extra day of sitting in the fish <laughs> yeah. and chips office. No, wait. What do you I mean? You've been confused. Here. So she ordered in advance, she ordered or she in ordered in and it's taken a full she ordered day from six p.m. yesterday, and she's still there six thirty the next day. <laughs> yeah, I thought it took them a full day to make yeah. it for her. A day okay. and thirty minutes. <laughs> still no fish and chips. Yes. No, people have been waiting literally. Over an hour for right. their fish and chips, and they're just standing there waiting for the fish and chips. Right. And it's over like, twenty four hours are you in some cases. Serious? Just have fish and chips tomorrow, bro. Well, what, you're there, so you can't. What did you do? You guys said eventually. Fuck this. We yeah. waited. Put our fish and chips in the bin. Yes, and yeah. we got there, and then we said, "Can we get a refund after a while?" Uh, this, okay, this is a bit of an "Am I the asshole?" story. Okay, go on. Oh, I love this. I was just sitting there playing chess. Wait, okay, you need to type this up as like a redditor. Yeah, <laughs> oh, I okay. be me playing chess okay, in yeah, the yeah. fish and chip shop. Yeah, yeah. am yeah. I the asshole? Okay, Holly's like, we've got to get fish and chips. It's Good Friday. Okay, I'm Wait, like, who was there in the shop? No, no, this is at home. Okay, I'm like, so you me twenty six m yeah. yeah. am sitting in sitting in the house saying, we're not Christian. <laughs> Let's just have fish and chips tomorrow. I can't be bothered dealing with the craziness Crowd, yeah. of fish and chips. Yeah. Holly's like, nah, got to have fish and chips. I'm like, you deal with all of it and then I'll eat the fish and chips. Smart. <laughs> got it. Yeah. That's a good play. That's like, a bit of male behaviour, isn't like, it? I'll, like, I'll come along in the car or whatever. Like, <laughs> But I'm not interacting with you. I'm playing chess. <laughs> okay? no, no, no. So I'm, just know you'll be sitting there by I'm yourself. I'm not going to be the one to like go and get the fish and uh -huh. chips. Yeah. I'm excluded from the responsibility of right, it. Right, because you didn't want to do it, so you feel like because that should I be Because I think we off. shouldn't be doing it. I'm off. What were you wanted? What did you want to do? Just eat anything else. Okay. Have fish and chips tomorrow. So she's quite like strict on this, not having meat. Yeah, because I think she grew up with it. So weird. But there's nothing else Christian about it. Yeah, this is the same yeah. with Jill, and I just don't understand. We had this big not argument, but I was just like, why? Because this is what I'm saying. I'll come you back to my story. Yeah, yeah. Go I'm, on. I'm, I'm saying the fish and chips is yummy, so I can get behind it. Yeah, yeah. just do it tomorrow. Anyway, we get to fish and chip store. It's crazy busy, right? Right. I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> I ain't dealing with this. Right. I'm just gonna sit down. Holly's like, I'm gonna try and get to the front so I can get a re refund. So there's a crowd for massive. Cr the whole store is and full. everyone's people are got outside their out the yelling. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, I'm gonna sit down in this chair. I'm gonna play some chess. Did good, they? Good sorry. luck, soldier. D oh well, you're not even helping. I didn't go up to the front to try and get there. I think you should have done that. Maybe, but I said at the start. I'm yeah, hands off. I still think you should have helped. Yeah, so did she. But <laughs> yeah, well, I'm with her. On eventually, that. <laughs> Holly's about to be fucking vindicated. Yeah. With listening to this story. Eventually, man. we get the refund. Uh huh. After like, I think it was we were in the store for forty minutes. Whose idea was it to get the refund? That was the goal. Get the refund. So wait, you went to the store just to get the refund. There was no. No, when they got there, you they realised it was effed. 
And yeah. John said, yeah. I'm playing chess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Was Holly happy to wait for the refund or? Well, you kind of had to. Whose idea was it to get the refund? Uh, Holly. Or was it? Okay. Jordan hasn't done anything in this whole story. I was thinking Holly's waiting in line for 40 minutes and you're playing chess for 40 minutes. Jordan thinks he's done a a really good thing for everyone by turning up and playing chess. (laughs) No, I don't think I've done anything good, but I've just, that's my whole point. Also, you're more just posting saying, I'm the arsehole. (laughs) (laughs) Am I the neutral? Anyways, we do that and then we go get some KFC after and it was great. It was done so quick. And the chicken. And we ate chicken. How did Jesus', Sorry, Jesus. flesh taste, you fucking <laughs> <Delicious. asshole. laughs> Right, Delicious. Finger licking really good. <laughs> and it was... <laughs> um, okay. Oh, anyway, is that yeah. the story? I guess so. Yeah, so, okay. And she's upset at you, but she's over it by the time you get KFC. Uh, ah, yeah. yeah. Mm, that's what you think. <laughs> She'll bring this up in six months when you're having an she's unrelated gonna, yeah, argument. Listen to the podcast and then be like, I knew it. Well, you were playing chess in the fish and chips <laughs> yeah, store. Yeah. But look, just don't get fish and chips on Friday. And then on the... Yeah. Holly but don't st- you think like no. when you're in a relationship, I'm not, but don't you think you need to be like, okay, that's what you want to do. Let's do it. Huh? It's like you're a team. You should be on nah. a team trying to get the fish and chips. Because if I yeah. say to Holly, I really want to go get, I don't know, some... Charizard plushies yeah. from this place. She would, and it's I, so I would busy. Guess, I don't know. She would be like, "All right, I'll come with you." Well, I'll I be think, down I if she, she said, would. "I'm gonna just look in this store while you go in that store or something." Yeah, but I'll when like, there's yeah, a okay. problem, and I feel like she would help you. I tell you what, mm. I don't you think mm. I'm, this is not gonna be helpful at all for you, Jordan. This guy, <laughs> he's cutting this uh, out. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Jordan. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> edit in your voice and say, "Yes, good idea, Jordan." <laughs> <laughs> Respect. You know, it is, Get that elo, brother. <laughs> it is interesting that Jordan's come out the gate with his strongest opinions on the episode of the podcast that he's edited. Yeah, That's he's getting true. Oh, he's really getting it off his chest. That's true. Um, when we were in Japan, Jordan, you were like very easygoing, like for the most part, like didn't really care where we went and what we did. Like Jordan was just yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like sounds good. Yeah, like come with us for all that. Yeah. But then the the one thing Jordan wanted to do, like specifically, you wanted to like cl- do the hike through the like thousand gates. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like. Uh, that was the one thing you wanted to do? Yeah. And Holly was like, yep, I'll come along and do that with you. And it was like a few hour hike and like we split up as a group. So like... That is true. And What's that was the one she thing you wanted to do? chess on her phone doing that? No. But I wouldn't... And the one, thing you, <laughs> the one thing she wanted to do is get her fish and chips. That's and you true. Were like, I was still in the store to play chess. Very different scenarios. Won a match. That's Lost a match. Kind because of pointless. One one. <laughs> Elo, back to normal. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Everything even as it should be. <laughs> it was kind of like I didn't need to play chess yeah, at all. Yeah. As it turns out, waste of time. <laughs> no, no, no. You got a refresher. <laughs> yeah, it's I haven't played chess in a while. Yeah, really you can't be fun. too rusty on the chess. You never know when you're going to be in a life or death chess situation. Exactly. You always got to stay, you know. A little bit proficient be, yeah, in your oatmeal. Stay ready, don't gotta get well, ready. I was fully prepared to be on your side because I find the not eating meat tradition and people that follow it that aren't religious. That's what I mean. I because w- I yeah, like it was hard the to idea. not be on Jordan's side, but somehow we're both Yeah, there. well I'm not. We're both not on I like the idea of like if you fast and I think that's good. I reckon people should commit more, not just be like, Oh, eat chocolate, have fish and chips. Well, Similar situation. Am I the whatever? I'm not really. There's no. Oh, do we all have an "Am I the asshole?" Yeah. Easter story. Ooh. Well, I just had this, so. My sister and her partner came down from from they live up north, mm-hmm. uh, and Jill loves when he cooks steak on the barbecue because he's really good at it. Your sister's boyfriend. Yeah. Yeah. I said. Perfect. Friday, I'm free. Let's do it Friday. (laughs) (laughs) It'll be a good Friday. (laughs) I didn't click that it was good Friday. She said, Mm. we cannot have meat on good Friday. And I said, you don't follow any rules. Why are you starting now? And we had this big discussion anyway. She won, of course. Has she done it in the past? Is it's it like a bit no, hard to argue with someone so who's like... So it's not even a yearly Good Friday a thing for Jill? No, she doesn't eat meat on a Good Friday. Okay. Every yeah. year. Yeah. Uh, except for fish. But she's not Christian in any other way. No, zero religion. Doesn't, like I said, doesn't adhere to... <laughs> Hate religion, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Actively dislikes it. Yeah. So I thought that was bizarre, um, but I wasn't allowed to say that I guess it's I a bit it, hard to argue with your grandma yeah she's been around a long time you know yeah. she's wiser than me in a way no she, well, I think, well I'm wiser than her we, yeah, we know that. we found out <laughs> I think it's the fact that like a lot of our families have like 
old religion roots. Yeah. Like we used to not eat fish on Good Friday and like my grandparents, I think, used to go to church, but then my parents stopped it and then I'm like the... I no, never actually heard of it. Until but I Holly. asked, Jill didn't even grow up in a religious household, which is just not making any sense to me. People do Because for me, it's tradition. like if it's a tradition, yeah. yeah. I don't it, get it. Uh, yeah, me too. I think people are too traditional sometimes without thought. Yeah, just let, let's Such move as forward. the chocolate eggs. Like, I'm just like, Holly, just give me some protein bars. Yeah. Uh, but there's something like... Where they should make protein eggs. Ooh. Best of both. Well, not... I know there's lots of protein in chicken yeah, eggs. Yeah, just have a normal egg. No, <laughs> egg. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to start doing that more. Or have chocolate eggs. coated... <laughs> Regular eggs. Yeah. <laughs> but people are like, so bad. Easter Easter comes you got to make sure you tell someone before they yeah. buy it. Easter comes that. around and people are like, oh, so much chocolate. Oh, I don't want to eat chocolate. And it's like, just don't. Oh, yeah, that's okay. <laughs> no, this is but the same then, problem I have with Christmas where I'm like, no one buy me presents. And then everyone's like, oh, Grinch, Grinch. And I'm like, what are you, you can't <laughs> win. What's the Easter yeah. version of a Grinch? Like a tortoise? Yeah, the opposite, the opposite of a bunny. Of a, yeah, yeah, I like that. <laughs> the Easter oh, stop tortoise. Being such a fucking tortoise. You're a tortoise. I'd be like, thank you very much. <laughs> so yeah, that's my opinions on all of that. Do you reckon Jesus is a bit pissed? What do you mean? Because well, he like, did drink a lot of wine. We're right? supposed yeah. to like yes. what is it? He died on the cross, and it's like people will remember this day forever. And they then have. it cuts, and it's just like rabbits and chocolate. It's like where did those come from? <laughs> oh, interesting. <laughs> yeah. Like he's just like, hang on a minute. Yeah, it's like, yeah. Hey, Jordan, you forgot the hot cross buns. Yeah, where did those He's come got the from? cross on for the <laughs> crucifix. Oh, is that why? I'm going to say that's so. That's probably why. I never put I'm that gonna, together. That's the missing link. We found it. Hot cross buns. Now I'm curious about hot cross buns. I actually didn't eat one hot cross bun and I'm quite oh, a Oh, you're missing out. Hot cross buns are the I one did thing one that for breakfast. gets like gate-kept, gate-kept to only Easter. Mm. And Why? Oh my god! They should I be never an all year round. The cross thing. is on. The, so yeah, but the cross isn't accurate. Here you go. Uh, the bun marks the end of the season of Lent, which is what you were talking about. Yeah, the fasting. And different parts of the hot cross bun have certain meanings, including the cross representing the crucifixion of Jesus, the spices inside signifying the spices used to embalm him oh, at his wow. burial, and sometimes also orange peel to reflect the bitterness of his time on the cross. <laughs> I would be bitter if I was on the cross. Who made it though? Who made it? Because they say all that and it might be like, and it invented 50 years ago by some man at the supermarket. Yeah, probably. Did they Which really is always embalm so funny. Jesus only for him to come back and be like, yeah, oh, there's cinnamon in my eyes. What does that mean? He didn't actually come back. This is what I thought as well. But he's like, he doesn't come back. Shit. Just like real life. He didn't come back. Do you know that? He did, didn't he? he no, did. that's after, what I thought. He after didn't... three days, he rose again. No, he rose to heaven is what it was. Oh. Yeah, I thought he comes back and he's chilling with everyone again. Yeah, oh, I think geez. he did do that. No, yeah, yeah, that's what no. I thought. Yeah, it doesn't. They, he goes, I he doesn't, was, <laughs> yeah, no, he doesn't, he doesn't do that. <laughs> that's what I thought. I, thought I think it's a common like misconception. A, I'm back, yeah, yeah like see, people thing. say he doesn't respawn. I th- Okay, Australia, Shit. as you guys are probably learning, is very. Not religious. Sacrilegious. I don't know what that means, but I'll agree. I think um, that's right. Sounds good. I thought he comes back, but no. He dies on the cross. They chuck him in a tomb and he rose to heaven. They open the tomb and he's not there. Oh. But throughout my whole life, I think rose from is the dead. Oh, how how so funny that's is the idea of them burying him? Be like, let's have a look. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's like, hang on, he's gone. <laughs> well, we're just yeah. Gonna, uh, yeah. It's plus to meet some kids like, Jesus isn't there, yeah. let's have a look. Anyone get pranked at all yesterday? Oh, I, I did a lot of pranks. Oh, okay. did you? Go on then. Um, oh, shit, I'll have to think of them. They're all on Maddie. I was being a bit of a. Oh, really? You're a bit of a menace? Yeah. I don't do anything. I don't do anything April either. Fools. That's just, I'm so, I find that so great that you, you, you actually committed. <laughs> spent all Monday. Oh, I, I actually looked on, on Reddit. I Googled, like, what were some funny April Fool stories. That I, I saw can someone read. said that Fremantle's name was officially changed to Frio. Which is not oh, interesting yeah. to anyone listening to this. <laughs> uh, that's more of a local one. Yeah, that's kind of who cares. It's the best one I saw, which yeah, is, doesn't damn. say a lot. No, that's not. Well, the I can't think of any of the ones that I pulled on Maddie. It was just like probably really shit ones. Well, seemingly, yeah. <laughs> you know, the cl- if they're like, not memorable, yeah. I'll tell you one that I thought of doing. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> sure. I was going to call her in the supermarket and say I spilled the milk everywhere and that she had to come. But then she found me. 
<laughs> the chest. Oh, I'm surprised she doesn't just like go away. Wasn't for that a very thing. good April Fools for your local prankster, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was <laughs> running out of ideas. So what do you think? She like runs into the aisle and you're just standing there and there's you're like, ha, ah, <laughs> no <laughs> milk on the floor. <laughs> So I looked on Reddit and I looked up what are some great April Fool stories uh, and I thought that might be fun to discuss. Should we rate them? Yeah, 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 let's rate them. Let's do fool or cool. Oh, yes! <laughs> 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 I didn't realise there was such a good rhyme in yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, fool or cool. Fool or cool. So fool's bad and cool's good. April yes. fool's or April cool's? Okay, how many do I have? Because if, if are you the April fool, fool or are you the yeah. April cool? Okay, got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this pet. Oh, yeah. Oh, I've got a reminder for something. I'll look at that you later. You didn't have to. I've opened it and what it's in it? front of the Reddit. Oh, uh, this is so awkward. What's the reminder for? I'm not sure. I'm trying to cancel Go on it. Self report. What's the reminder? I'm J- trying to oh, open a message from my <laughs> mum now. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, Go mate, to I, bathroom I, at Zach's house and <laughs> jack off. Don't forget to it's drop a It's a reminder load. for the dentist. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. So are here you meant to be there now? Yeah. What the heck? <laughs> What's no. going to the dentist? It's like when you know how they're like you're in a loop. What? Like no. they're like come back in a year. Oh or right. Whatever, six I need months. to go actually soon. Anyway, my grandpa <coughs> was Sorry, from. <laughs> <laughs> my grandpa was from Turkey, and his family didn't keep birth records when he came to the U.S. They made him pick a birthday. And it was April 1st. So he told them today was his birthday. For 50 years, we all thought his birthday was actually April 1st. And then two years before he died, he revealed his birthday was in August. And he laughed for 45 minutes. He lied to us for 50 years. Yeah, April Cools. That's, That's a pretty so good, one. good. Yeah, April Cool. I love that he's laughing at his own joke for 45 minutes. <laughs> That's, That's the best time. part. I mean, it would be even funnier if he just laughed until he died. Yeah. <laughs> he died laughing, literally, <laughs> for at his, his own April joke. Fool's Wait, what joke. was that? Do we get to know the situation that he told him? Nah, that's like, all the info I've got. Was it on the April Fool's? And he was like, he got, everyone, hey "Guys, we can't everyone, keep doing this." <laughs> what if everyone yeah, because they're all saying happy birthday every yeah. April Fool's, yeah. and it's so funny that it's like recurring inbuilt April Fool's joke is like everyone's telling you happy birthday. <laughs> Did you say two years before he died? Yeah. Oh, mm. he's timed that well because he has the reason he tells him on April first that he's like, "My birthday's actually in August." Yeah. Gets three more birthdays. presents in August. Ooh. And if you time it close to your death, you get the most amount of prank. Yeah. Like years. Yeah. 50 and years then you of wanna, prank. Yeah, you want to time it right before you die. And he's done it. Yeah. He's pulled it off to get one extra birthday. That's very Phenomenal. Good. So that's a cool. What a play. <laughs> that's right. April Cools for me. Next one. When I was a kid, my mum made the same breakfast each day of the week. Pancakes on Sunday, cheese toast on Monday. One year when I was eight or nine. Sorry, cheese toast for breakfast. That's a lunch toast. Cheese toast is a bit not and pancakes. This kid's probably got diabetes. <laughs> um well one year when I was eight or nine, April Fool's was on a Tuesday, but she made English muffins and eggs. So I thought it was Wednesday all day. Okay, yeah. You gotta tell us which day of the week English muffins and eggs is. I don't well, think get, was there more information that story that skipped? All, that's all of it. All of it. Um I April, think April calls, but April Fools for the storytelling. Yeah. For me. I don't know. I, I can't <laughs> see it. All I know is what you gave well, me. Oh, I just read what it said. You're then bad. It's just a Reddit post. Go on. I think the coolest part of that story is having a day for each breakfast. Yeah. I might That's start putting that funny. into I've always respected the people that have like different underwear for each day of the week. Oh, I yeah. wish I had. You respect <laughs> Yeah, I wish I could get to that level. Oh, bro. I'm not it on that. Tuesday. I'm not on the ones that say Monday. No, they don't have to say, but Today as long is. as you know which one's which. Right. Today is English Muffin Wednesday. Yeah. On like, the, what on about rainbow? Fuck, maybe I'll do rainbow undies. Oh, because there's there seven colors. Bit of yeah. Well, there's, there's Red, technically orange, six yellow. in the Yeah, in but the there's, they say there's You can seven. add, yeah, you can add indigo. Seven sounds nicer. Yeah. What do you mean they say there's indigo? It is doesn't indigo. really exist. Huh? Anyway, <laughs> All it's right. a myth. What are you talking about? Just okay. <laughs> how many upvotes did that last one have? No, but you know how people have like dinner nights. One thousand nine hundred. What? Yeah. Okay. People, all the people have like Tuesday's steak night. Yeah. Like Wednesday's chicken night. <sighs> are you thinking of I feel pubs? like this is an old thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> it is a good inbuilt kind of uh, mix-up. This is an old family thing that like right. lots of like old people are like. 
we can't do that. Thursday's lasagna night. The and issue, they really stick by it. Yeah, mm. but the issue is, and you've got to cook so much, because I'm kind of like, cook once, and then it's that's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, <laughs> Thursday <laughs> night, you know? Yep, I made right. a tuna bake last night, and it's tuna <laughs> bake week. Yeah, It's exactly. every night. Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, that might be a better play. Have different uh, weeks. So you have 52 True. different dinners. I've been trying to get into a routine. For, oh, wait, like, oh, sorry. Here we go. 52 different dinners, so like... <laughs> eat, you could only eat pasta for one week of the year. Oh, maybe <laughs> then, there could be some repeats. No, no, I'm liking this. <laughs> yeah, if you set it up beforehand and it's just a list, you're like, oh man, that spaghetti bowl was so good, but it's not going to come around Hang for on, another the year. The third week of October is lasagna week. <laughs> Yeah, what if you're like away for one of the weeks? Does that just Oh, get... and you miss it. Yeah, you're just like, damn, Shit, I was wait hell looking forward to lasagna. lasagna. <laughs> oh, tell you what, if you have fish and chips early in the year, you're going to be fucked on Good Friday. Yeah. True. Well, maybe you could do it all twice. So that, do you guys have, reckon you've had 52 dinners? Different yeah. ones. I reckon I've had more than that. Yeah, So it's going to be easy then. Easy peasy. Yeah. <laughs> Once we got a new <laughs> printer delivered on April 1st at my office, someone left a note on it that it was voice operated. And as everyone yelled at the um, poor printer, printers don't have feelings, to do things, there were even uh, accusations that it didn't understand the foreigners because they had accents and the Americans had taken over. Ooh. It was brilliant. I mean, the the real joke's been played on the people whose fucking underlying racism's come out, Wait, hasn't it? What? No, no, the for, no the foreigners. I think are uh, annoyed because the printer's not working for them. Oh, they have that. So wait, they have accent. Where's the April Fool's part of this? <laughs> the, the the printer isn't voice operated. That's good. Yeah, but how is it working <laughs> for some people's voices? It's not. It's not. But they go up to it and then they're like, oh, "Okay, my turn for the printer," so and then wait. they say something in an accent. So you're saying that like. Uh, I'm assuming the opposite of foreigners is like a white American or something. Yeah. You're saying they go up to the printer and they're like, print. And then it's like, ah, oh, it doesn't work. Must like must not be voice activated. I think they, okay, I think I'm getting it. They send a document to be printed and they go, print. And then it does because they've done it, not because of the voice activation. No, I think it's just so not working at all. But if you go up to it, you're going to assume that it's racist. It's like the scar what? theory. But then what are the other people thinking? Then they're just thinking it doesn't work. Like, say right. I go up to a printer and it doesn't work. I'm like, shit, it doesn't work. But let's say I go up to a printer and then I'm like, shit, it's racist. There's there's a bit of a petition going on in the chat for Zach to read these out and not Jordan. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Look, get Zach to read them out instead. Why? Zach should read them. Zach, Why? read them. Yeah, protest, I'll protest. I'll take one for the team. Why? Zach, 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 read them. them. Zach, read Hang them. on, there's, not, there's more to this one, though. You've been demoted. You're but, done. Right. Do You're you guys done. know about the SCAR experiment? It'll be like that. What's going Jordan, are these photos of Reddit articles taken on your phone? Yes. Not, what do you mean? not screenshots. Me. Oh, photos. Jordan! Because <laughs> I was looking on my computer. He's literally <laughs> taking a photo of the screen. <laughs> what are you, a grandmother? On my <laughs> <laughs> no wonder you're not reading them out very well. It's a fucking photo of your screen. I was looking at the computer. On the phone. <laughs> Screenshot them on the computer. How? All right, guys. There's you can screen, you press uh, Alt, Shift. But then what? And then I'm going to send it to myself. On Facebook. You know what's quicker? <laughs> Boom. Done. Yeah, but it's working terribly. Okay. No, it's working fine. Okay, this no, but I haven't got about the you scar theory. You have a protest theory. on your hand. You have a mutiny. I have got to say about the scar out. theory. It's like, if you think stuff is racist, you've got to even believe more so that it's racist. Well, how is that a scar theory? Okay, so the scar theory is there's job interviews, right? Okay. And then it's they're like, we're going to put a scar on your head. What? Makeup wise. Yeah, yeah. And so, and you're going to see, like, it's like an experiment. <laughs> and so, <laughs> why are you yawning? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so they go and they put makeup and they put a big scar on these people's heads. Okay. And then they say, like, before, they're like, okay, hang on, we're going to touch it up a bit. And take it off. And they take it off. And then they go in for the job interview and then they ask them afterwards questions such as did the person notice that you had a scar like how did it go did it go poorly because do you think because of the scar and they're like yes they noticed the scar like i don't know the exact percentages but like let's yeah. just say 90 yeah. of the people are like yeah they treated me differently because i had a scar yeah so it's a scar confirmation theory. bias yeah yeah, yeah yeah 
So if you think things are racist, then you'll think more things are racist. Uh, well, I think you should stop reading them, and Zach's going to start reading. All right, Zach. All scroll right. to this. <clears throat> to, like, move your thumb to, to the yeah. right. Okay, but not no, that you move oh, it to the left. Better not scroll in the wrong direction. Yeah, there's All photos right. of me on Here this. Here we side. go. <laughs> Not just April Fool's Day, but I purchased 200 mini rubber ducks and have been hiding them in everybody I know's house and vehicles. It's been going on for almost two years and nobody has figured out where the hell they're coming from. I think I've heard something like this before. So, uh, did they say not April Fool's? Because it's not April Fool's. No, oh, they, they just said they just that. do it all the time. Yeah. yeah. I've, I've seen more of like the once-off where you put like 200 rubber ducks in someone's bathroom. I yeah. think that's a classic thing. <laughs> that's pretty funny if it's just like... Constant mysterious one-offs. Yeah, yeah. You'd think you were going a bit insane. Yeah. So here's here's the review from Zach reading it out. Yeah, that was so much clearer. Oh my god, I agree. No, I no, no, understood I that can, completely. Let me read the next one. I, I reckon I can do you it. You want redemption? Yeah, redemption. All, all right, right, all right, fine. What wasn't that one of my goals? The speaking? speed was crazy. Like, and it's true. You reading out the Apple review the other week. So fast. Oh, thank you. You're a very good reader. Okay, this is a big one, though. This is a bit unfair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll do it, no Zach worries. Do no, it. No, no. <clears throat> I'll take control if you right, you're on. You're on thin ice, okay? okay if you okay. mess up, you're li- instantly demoted. <laughs> so clear your throat, take your time. And I think on. they did this... I think they worded it bo- poorly, because it starts off with C, comma. Oh, hang on. <laughs> take your time, take your time. Nah, okay, I'm just going to send it. When you start, you yep. don't stop. <laughs> oh, I get it. Good. See someone at work eating something in the morning. <laughs> You're out. Sure. You're done. You're done. John, Look over the It's over. <laughs> Ten out. <laughs> see you later. That was too much pressure. Uh, that was too much pressure. See someone see, it's talking in the morning. It's like C, comma. No, what let, is that? Okay. Let, let Zach try. <laughs> Zach's going to fail. No. It's if Zach see, messes up, I come back. See I think someone turn. at work eating... You're done. You're done. Jack is done. Jack is done. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. I got stitched up. So we, <laughs> we're trying to read a Reddit post off a fucking a photo yeah. off the screen. I, I do not like the screenshot method one bit. Okay. See someone at work eating something in the morning. Walk over to them as if you're trying not to laugh. How's your breakfast, you ask? Whatever they say, walk off smirking. Throughout the day, you keep asking them at least every hour, how are you feeling after your breakfast? Maybe drop a, you're looking a bit pale, might have been the breakfast. I guarantee that if you do it right, they'll be sick or develop actual unwellness. Oh, Holy you did that well. Shit. Well done. Well did done. Did we just learn how to put a curse on someone? What? So it's That's like if, last you, one, if you just keep acting like their breakfast. Yeah, I like that. Sick. That's a bit like the scar theory in a way. Yeah. I yeah. Think no. There's a bunch it of is. things you're like, that like... You're laughing at them like they've had something bad to but eat. But you're not believing it yourself. No, but they start Oh, you're right. Unwell. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You know, it is crazy that the human body will just like do that. Like if you think you're sick enough, then the body's just like, oh, fuck it. We're sick, I guess. Yeah. I've noticed that like if you're like... Um, no SIBO. When I get in the ice bath, because I get the gym... Uh, and if everyone in there is going, oh, it's so cold, it's so cold, it's colder. Oh, so you hit up the ice bath again. I hit up the ice right? bath. Again. We, I we heard about this. Wow. I retried. Did we talk about it on the pod? E- Basically, the first time you so. went in and there were a bunch of uh, what you described them as weak little girls. I said beautiful they were. ladies. <laughs> <laughs> well, either way, they were handling it a lot better than you. Is that right? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. How That's did you go this time? Correct. Uh, better. Um, I, wasn't, I was trying to just be in there. And not think about how cold it was. Next time, imagine it's boiling and you're in the desert. That's so smart. Then you'll get in and just be try like, it. Just this try is it. your now. Your theory was that I went to the doctors <laughs> yeah, and they did this. And they showed you photos of snow. No, I was playing. To cool him down. Uh, yeah. Wait, was, what? Do you I not was, remember this? I was playing a game. I still don't know what this game was or what was wrong with me. <laughs> but when I just remember kid. being in the hospital. Yeah, he was in the and hospital playing and there was penguins and snow. And they and cooled him down. to make me colder. That was a fucking dream, dude. I don't know what <laughs> I to say. I swear. I swear this is real. Mum, if you're listening to this, right, what so was I in hospital for? So you're imagining being in the desert then? I can only assume, Jack. Well, I no, wasn't, next time but I need should. to be. And he'll get a anyway, world record. Improved. But my point was more like, I wasn't thinking about how cold it was. Also, like, if you're thinking about how tired you are, you're going to be more tired. Wait, are you going in the ice bath after the gym? Yeah. After working out? Yeah. Ooh, bad. Hypertrophy killer. Yeah, yeah, hypertrophy killer, my man. man. Woo. When he's supposed to do it first. Uh, it's, it's great for recovery. Yeah. But you don't want your muscles to recover if you want them to grow. Because you want them to be damaged, then like rebuild. So you should do it the day after. But if you have an ice bath right after like lifting, yeah, okay. then it actually is kind well, of telling your muscles to like recover and not rebuild. Luckily for me, I'm not in there probably long enough to do anything substantial. Like I'm barely getting to a minute. 
Maybe you should get in first and Still then counts. work out. Interesting. Mm. Yeah, best time to have an ice bath is immediately after you wake up. Also, the time you want to have an ice bath the least. Do you guys remember micro trolling? Yes, no, I remember no. you coining the term. But yeah, I, I invented it. Back it's when pretty much just being a pest. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you did to Maddie on April Fool's? You can't, they weren't even good enough for you yeah, to remember them. Somewhat. Zach will go like, um, did you know that the you'd be at the Leaning Tower of Pisa, for example, and he'll go, did you know that it's actually straight? It's an optical illusion. And someone will go, oh, okay. And you go, jokes. <laughs> That's a micro troll. Am I no, right? no, no. Yes. Wait, it's a troll similar. so obvious. So no, it it's so minor that they don't even care. Oh, okay. It was invented by me back that when big trolling big. was like, really in you yep. know like fucking nine gag troll face sort of shit mm. uh, i would call Remember it that yeah <laughs> i would call it a micro troll and it's it's pretty much what jackson said but with one crucial difference okay you never tell them that it is oh right oh. that it's a prank a micro troll so the 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 number one outcome for a micro troll is you tell someone like a little tidbit a fact then they retain that information and go on to tell someone else. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's what I call the true the success. So it'd have to be even more subtle. I'd be like the Leaning Tower of Pisa. I'm like, oh, how crazy is it that they only built it in like five days, this whole tower? Yeah. Yeah. And someone's like, whoa. And then, it, uh, it, and then I have no And then Jordan idea. would say to me, Jackson, guess they what? They only built this in five days. <laughs> yeah. No, they didn't. It was, took them four weeks. Who told you that? Yeah, and then it's like someone else. What? <laughs> this is, this is peak, peak situation is Jordan goes, tell someone else. Yep. They know that he's lying, and yep. they're like, wow. "What are you on about?" And, and then, then you look like an absolute. No, fool. but then John goes, "Well, Zach told me that." And then what? No, I'm nowhere to be seen. <laughs> you got the troll. <laughs> you got a troll face. Yeah, Zach has on a his troll face. face. He's got the, like, <laughs> the really small one. <laughs> <laughs> this is years later that Jordan's bringing oh, up the okay. fact, and he doesn't. Yeah, yeah, and I wouldn't even know who I got the yeah. fact from anymore. I tell it in wow. such a way that it just sticks in the memory. Yeah. It's like implanting. Wow, you're so good. Brain thing. Yeah. He's the I've, one and only micro troller. I, I never do them on the podcast, though. That would be too many people affected. Well, the c- people in the comments call you out instantly if you try anything. Yeah, that, yeah, <laughs> that'd, that'd be that'd You wouldn't get away with it. Have you micro trolled me? Almost definitely. Uh, oh, back back in the day, of would have. Yeah. I wonder what Is I he, believe. You had about hung up the boots, haven't you? A bit really, the micro trolling. Uh, yeah, don't do it too much anymore. You know, the best the best ones are for the stuff that people really just do not give a shit about. Yeah. yeah. Like, so Smash Bros. Frame Data, that would have been a classic. Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> you're thinking like, oh, well, how'd you punish that? And I'm like, oh, Bowser's forward is like actually frame 10 out of shoot. <laughs> <It's like laughs> two frames different to what it actually is, but it's... <laughs> micro troll. That is micro. Gotcha. That is yeah, micro. And it sure. is a troll. The smaller, wow. the less chance it has of people questioning it. And that's where you get them. Yeah. Yeah. It's just the worst It has to be small or just like insignificant to be a good yeah, one. Yeah, your yeah. first one was a bad example because that was shocking was to me. I trying to think of yeah, something. It was shocking. too shocking yeah. that it's Leaning Tower is actually straight. No. But I would, five days, that's good. Yeah, yeah. I'm a bit that's of a master. Pro, I know, yeah. I know you're, it's you're gonna be master. just interesting enough that they might share the information, yeah. but you know, not not so that they want to Google it. So we call in this podcast explaining micro trolling. Micro trolling. Micro trolling explained. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone was the micro trolling iceberg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we go down Leading the iceberg of, like, <laughs> of the smallest micro trolls that have had yeah. the most cataclysmic effect. Do you yeah. know your biggest, your best micro troll? Oh, oh they're probably too micro. You've forgotten. What if I told my sister that like I didn't like bananas when I was five, and then oh I've trolled God. myself That's a by troll. developing, That's way a, too macro. developing a phobia? That's crazy. No, but I'm saying like, what if you had the little butterfly effect one? You tell a tiny little white lie, and then suddenly it's like chaotic evil behavior. Yeah, it is. Yeah, not chaotic. Neutral. No, it's kind of chaotic neutral. Nah, because you're. It, Putting you're deliberately doing incorrect information. Yeah. That's evil, mm. and it is chaotic. It's not in like a yeah. Good call. It's not just true evil or whatever it's called. I don't think there is a true evil. It's true neutral. Is it? Yeah. What's the other evils? Lawful. Lawful ne- evil? And neutral evil, yeah. Ne- what's neutral evil? What- Lawful evil, that must be like Hitler. Because didn't he make the law? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> There's better examples. Like what? Like who? Oh, shit. Yeah, 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 you can't say that and not have an example. Nah, um, from like a TV show, let's go with that Death Note guy that everyone liked. I haven't oh, seen that. Oh, yeah, light. All right, let's get into a game, fellas. He was a Raider boy. He said, what's your Raider boy? And my number is in my head now. Okay, Jackson's thinking of a number. Yeah. And we got to guess the number. Nah, by he should Google it because what if he's cheating? No, he's got. He, he can't got, cheat. 
<laughs> he's thinking of a number. He's not yeah, cheating. We could get your number and then you say, nah, it wasn't. I will not do that. Okay, I do not, I'm not competitive <laughs> about this game. If, I, if you guys right, guess we'll my number, then I've done a good job. All right, Jackson, give, oh, me, a team. Yeah, yeah. give me a celebrity you rate to. You rate. Sorry, you relate to out of 10. Like 10 being that I relate to them a lot. Yeah. And zero being they don't mean nothing. So, to Jackson, me. you've got a number in your head right now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, say okay. Jackson's number is a 10. He would choose. Uh, <sighs> Who he relates Michael to the most. Sarah, because he relates to him a lot. Right, I'm going to go with um, Glenn Howerton. Who the fuck? Oh, bad <laughs> idea, Zach. Um, is that Dennis the Dennis in Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Oh, I think that's a... I haven't seen it. You have to help. The actor or the character? Glenn Howerton. Okay, that's that's a high relatability because Jackson, I reckon, would so be listening to the Always, Always Sunny podcast. Oh. So he'd know the actual guy. And I reckon... He wouldn't have chosen it if he didn't relate to him much. Okay, that's good. I'm uh, gonna go with like a, I'm thinking like a seven. Okay, I'm gonna. How many f- questions do you guys do? Maybe we do get one each, each oh. and then one each and guess. That's I like that speed round. <sighs> Maybe one Shit. each and one together. Okay, cool. We get a joint question. Yeah. Okay. Uh, tasting of a. <laughs> uh, cuisine. Like ten being that I love that cuisine. Yeah, yeah, cuisine yeah, 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 yeah. Mexican. Oh, that's a high, high, high. That might be an eight. Should we just go with like a? Movie How could we separate like between like an eight, nine, and ten? That's what we need. What about like mm. eight, nine, and ten? Mm. What's something we know Jackson loves and that he'd give a ten for Duck sure? Hunt. Duck Hunt. Okay. Uh, Duck Hunt. <laughs> Smash Bros. characters. To play or to look at to or play, play as, play as. Yeah. Yep. Diddy Kong. That's it's a nine. I, I reckon think. eight. No, Diddy's not a nine. Diddy. That's like an Ica room in a night. Do we have to choose the same number? I'm going to go with eight. Nine. I think it should be teamwork. Nah, Up to you guys. Nah, we're we'll I feel for, like it's funny. It's like nah, you guys the team's disbanded, yeah. Jake. Yeah. Right, eight and nine. Who's what? I'm eight. I'm nine. Zach's right. Oh, yeah, that's why you don't team with this fucker. Diddy Kong is an eight, I think. Shit. Yeah, Duck Hunt's right. ten. Meta Knight probably a nine. Rob. Rob and that means probably a nine. I get to go next. So I'm going to generate a number. You guys ask me your questions. Ooh. I wasn't ready for this game. Oh, I love that the chat all plays along. That's fun. There was a lot of nines as well. You guys are with me. Um, all right. You go. If you have one. <coughs> all right, I got a number. I'm thinking of a number between one and ten. <laughs> Ask me questions to guess what it is. I feel like we should don't you have to do rehash like the rules, like I just did. Okay, I think people, people get it. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> I didn't know how many people were following along. I reckon it maybe was a we good could example. do it as part of like Skater Boy still. I think we should do our total score. Sorry, Jackson, but so you're on yes. zero. Because it's like golf, oh, lower score Oh, yeah, lower score wins. And I also get a zero because someone got it. Yep. So confusing. So you're on one. I'm on one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We got, Zach and I got par. <laughs> you're on bogey. Oh, that's a bad idea. You should just get a point if you get it right. No, no, I no, no, no. I love that. It needs to be how close you get because it's yeah, like, what if you get rewarded for being off. close. Fucking hell. So no one gets like a minus one. No one's under par. No, you can't be under par. It's a tough game. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, what's the question? <laughs> Uh, if you were to grow hair on your body everywhere, <laughs> how happy would you be that this place grew hair? Is it places that currently don't have hair? Everywhere has it. So, like, okay, for example, beard would probably be pretty high because you're yeah, still happy okay, it grows. Okay, yeah, that'd okay. be a ten. And a low one would be like your forehead or something. <laughs> oh god. This well, is... I mean, that's up to you how you feel about it, though. Yeah. 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 Well, wow, that's a great question. <laughs> a very interesting question. Mm-hmm. Yeah. How you did, the how did you come up with that? Just looked at my legs. Oh. I saw this bit of hair. That's good. I'm going to go with belly. Okay. So I'm thinking middle ish. I was thinking middle ish. Middle for high. Sure, because six, it's seven. covered, so you can't be that annoyed. Yeah. At it. Six or seven, I'm thinking. But yeah, I'm thinking six or seven too. Okay. Um, pff, method of uh, dying. Oh, God. You have to say where. 10 is your most wanted. 10 is like, that's the best death ever. I love dying like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, please let me die um, like that. One is like the worst death ever. Like, I hate to die like this. Please, no. 
I was thinking of torture, but I don't know many torture mm. torches. Car crash. Pretty mid. Pretty mid, yeah. <laughs> so none are really good, are they? I'm leaning to a six or seven still. I'm feeling six or seven. Car crash. There's not a lot of build up most of the time, so it's probably. A g- I'm thinking higher now. Okay, but it belly does would leave probably be pretty high. I'm, this le- does leave itself to a few different. I'm answers. thinking a seven now. I think that's brought it up a You've bit. You've lost for me. the six. Ditch the six. Are we thinking seven, eight for you? Not eight. Okay. I think eight. He would have done something else. Okay. I'm thinking That's seven, true. but we have one more question to work with. Um, I think something like maybe like a type of art. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't get it. Oh wait, yeah, that's not how this works, is it? Type of art? No, no, yeah. I so don't like, understand it either. Type of art. So, like, if he loves TV shows, that's a ten. Oh. He would say TV shows. Oh, like. And it. if he doesn't like paintings, he would say paintings. As is a there art. much more than TVs? And so paint? many different types of art. Okay, we'll do types of art. Lock it in. Let me just give you some Zacks if you're no. struggling. No, doesn't need it. All right. Perfect. Paintings. <laughs> he said it. With not much. That's pulled me back down to six and I'm but going Maybe six. he's trying to trick us. He's not, No, his goal is to get us as close as possible. That is my goal. That is your goal. He Wait, went, why don't I just tell you the number? That's didn't. my goal. <laughs> but he didn't say paintings. He said Painting. I think it was because he was unsure about his answer more than his. Um, I think it's brought me down from a seven back to a six. It's both going the with way six. he's pronounced it. No, I'm going with six as well. Six, five. Mm. Ooh, there's even worse. So everyone gets one. There's a lot of uh, forms of art that I like better. Paintings yeah. are kind of very mid. Well, paint. I was up at seven, and painting brought me back. There were lots, <laughs> lots worse than paintings as well. Sculptures. What? I thought you were you were up at seven a.m. today painting. No, no, no. <laughs> and it brought me back, guys. Sculptures, one of the worst forms of art. No, I've no, been back, to agree. In, back in the day, they were pretty cool. But I went to. We have this like sculptures by uh, the sea. Oh, yeah, don't even get me. <laughs> yeah, don't get me. Sculptures oh, exhibition God. here in Perth and down to zero down by the sea. Yeah, and it'll be like a bent piece of metal. I and just it's think like, it's Whoa. just oh, right. rubbish. Anyway. The worst sculptures you've ever seen. All right, uh, you're on two. We're both on one. Heading into the last round. Yep. All right. I, th- I really thought you were about to say a number. <laughs> no. <laughs> Are you still okay, got a number? I'm going to say fighting style in UFC. There's not enough of them. I don't know if you'd, I would go with that. Oh, really? What about fighting style in as a whole? Okay. Fighting like your, style. Your preference. So, like, kung fu might be really what do you mean sick. my preference? And then well, that's what the whole game is. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Like in your you, opinion, I, like... Oh, if my opinion on what, how good this fighting style is. No, no, but it could be any like it. fighting style. So what do like, you mean like it? No, so... No, is it like it or effectiveness? Um... Let's go with like it. Yeah, so jujitsu is uh, probably like close to the top. So, I would for imagine. instance, a one might be like trying to scratch each other with fingernails. Yeah, you might not like that. That's not much. in the UFC. No, I'm taking. Yeah, you got rid of UFC. Not, uh, not in the UFC. Just in general, fight ways to fight. Coward punch is zero. Huh. <laughs> I think I kind of. It's a h- tough question. Just choose one. The question sucks. Yeah, Let's just just move come on, on. Zach. He, he's Zach throwing on purpose. No, because like <laughs> scratching. Would like I would like it in what way to watch it or to have it done to me or to do it? It's just anything. I don't care. You have to pick one. Okay, he's I'm allowed to ask questions. You have to you have to help him because it's like oh yeah, okay. like kicking um, someone in the balls. That's a zero out of ten to do to me, but maybe I'd love to do it to someone else. All right, you you're doing it to someone else to defend yourself. Um, you're being attacked by me, and you get to choose one, and you get to choose, and I get to your... choose what I would like to do to you th- yeah. on a scale, and you yeah. can't <laughs> kiss me. <laughs> Okay. Sexy wrestling. <laughs> Mud wrestling. I'm going to say... Um, kicking your shin. Okay. <laughs> that's giving I don't me know. no information. And that's your fault. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm aware it's my fault. I'm trying to okay. move on. Liquid to drink. Ten being you love this liquid. Zero being that's no good. This is a better. said liquid and not drink. Yes. So does that include like gasoline? Anything that's a liquid. Right. So we're including. So five is really like it's drinkable. <laughs> and then below that's yeah. like, I don't want to drink that at all. Right. So you've got like liquid to drink. blood. Yeah. Your blood would be low. You've got petrol. Petrol's you've probably got, a bit higher than blood. For uh, me. Euthanasia, liquid. Yeah. That'd be low. Lots I'm going to go stuff. with sweat. That's low. There, no, that's like a six. No way. That's like a four. If you think of all liquids. All liquids? I'm going, uh, okay. You'd rather drink sweat or tree sap? 
You got to be asking the hard yeah, questions. Yeah, but like three. Yeah, but uh, there's lots of things that'll kill you. Yeah. Snake venom. They're all one. Snake venom. Anyway, you drinking that? Can I change my answer? Nah, I think uh, that sounds like about a four. Well, maybe you should change your answer because I feel like this is we already fucked because the first question. <laughs> no, was no, no, this one. Will, okay, no, you guys can bring it back with one the last one. Yeah, this one will get us. Okay, we've got to and really I'll think about it more. Okay, what do you think we know the most about Jordan for the final question? Okay, good question. Because um, movies, I would have no fucking. No, idea. no, not movies. Kanye songs. But if it's a bad number, then that it sounds, would be Nah, Kanye song sounds funny, even if we don't know it. Okay. Let's just go with that. Kanye songs. Where five Jesus. is, it's good. No, five is the most middle song. And so imagine them. putting them all on a bell curve. Yeah, but don't include the ones that you don't know, because there's a lot. Yeah. So if it's like the worst one that you've ever heard, oh, that could be I a see, one. I see, I yeah. see. Yeah. Which is going to make it even harder. For yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, love it or whatever that one is with the it's bad. with the okay, it's what's a bad that? number. What's his name? I love it. Do, yeah, do, do, what's his do, name? Do, do, the guy. I don't know. Sixty nine or something. No. Oh, Lil I crash six my nine? car into Lil the Uzi. bridge. Lil the pump. Lil pump. I think it's Lil pump. Yeah. Yeah. This is probably a high one. Lil pump. Lil pump. Lil pump. I don't care. I love it. Wrong song. <laughs> no. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No. I'm, that's Kanye. <laughs> I'm going with <laughs> Kanye. I crash my car into the bridge. <laughs> I'm going with four. Something about four has just felt good for me since the start. I'm thinking three. It's a two. So it's a two. I damn. probably should have gone lower on the sweat thing. I didn't yeah, think there's about far worse like to drink. yeah. Also, what was the other one? Fighting skull, kicking someone in the shin is pretty hurt effective. Me. No, but no, it would it hurt, hurt me. Yeah. Have, if you've kicked someone's shin with your shin, it hurts. Oh, I didn't lot. know it was shin on oh, shin. Oh, you're shinning them in the shins. Oh, well, you just you kick their shin, it hurts. Yeah, it would hurt. Cause it it's hurt. pretty tough. Yeah, yeah. I, I rate it. Because you're not supposed to kick. You're supposed to. I yeah. think he's made a slight mistake with sweat, but other than yeah, that, the he's sweat, played pretty well. And that means I'm the winner. Uh, yeah, what Jackson's the winner. You, you're the loser. You and Zach drew. I was a bogey. Because no. he only got bogey. one. You got two for that. Oh shit! Yeah, we drew. Wow, double bogey. Do you want to go for a, <laughs> for a, a tiebreaker? <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah. A one question game yeah. with me. Okay. All right, I've got it. Wait, why don't we? Why don't you think of two separate numbers and we each get one question? Right, and we got to guess two okay. different numbers. Oh, so Jack. Wait, what? Yeah. So just <laughs> off one question. I've got your nah, number, nah. Jordan, and I've got Zach's number. Uh, place to live in the world. Mm. It's got to be low because he's thinking for too long. Paris. Oh. Yeah, I reckon people hate <laughs> Paris. Oh. I reckon it's a three. I'm going to go with the Pokemon design. Purely how they look. Hmm. Don fan. Oh, that's a fucking lit one. That's an eight. <sighs> Jackson likes people. Uh, seven. I'll bump it down to. I'm not three yet. I've not locked it in. I'm climbing up slowly. Because you like to kind of go and have a chat and talk to people, but you speak English. <laughs> and in Paris, they speak French. So that's a bit awkward. So I'm going to say four. That's a blessing. Because you had it. It was three. Fuck! Oh. And Zach's got it with a seven. No! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No! <laughs> oh, I can't believe I had it with a three. Nah, you... you he walked four. himself off Nah, it. you're a four. Nah, you'd like a little th- croissant. No, nah, Beach of Paris. You, I wouldn't want to live there. Yeah, but you would, would at least want a croissant. Yeah, that, that keeps that it up. A three would be... Nah, it'd be like a third world country or something. Jordan, that's the one. Nah. Jordan, don't be such a sore I'm so, loser. I'm such a sore loser. I came, well done. I came second fair and square. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot we were fighting for fucking me, second place. Me too. <laughs> Silver tie break. Ah, <laughs> oh, well done. Uh, guys, we're going to be reading out some five-star Apple Podcast reviews to end the podcast this week. And Ooh. just before we do that, we should tell everyone to head on over to the Patreon because we've got the new bonus shows up if you want some fun content. Oh, we do. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, they are. Oh, hell yeah. So They've we got two Q&As up. Last week. What else have we got up? Oh, they're up. Yeah. What's up? Uh, no, they're not now, but oh, by the damn. time this goes right, 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 right. Yo, they're up. Come on, guys. Right, try again, try again. So we got Jackson's movie night. Oh. Jordan's history man of the month. Yes. Zach's, we did my dream journal. Yeah. Talked about what my dreams meant and some Q&As. So the Patreon's never been more lit than today. And the movie was Midsommar. Midsommar. So if you've watched that or want to watch that, then watch it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here's You're welcome. A, yeah. I'm, I'm signing I'm up. actually a professional <laughs> advertiser. Here's a review from Caleb, our number one fan, apparently. 
It's me again, he says. I stand by my comparison of Jordan, the was I supposed to know guy. Is that from like a was I supposed to know? Like a sitcom? I don't know. I am a bit of a... supposed to know? It does sound like that. Was I supposed to know? It reminds me of... It does feel like a sitcom. That's one from um, Days of Our... No, Family something. Family Guy? No. No. (laughs) Close. (laughs) No, I haven't seen... I don't know. I haven't seen many sitcoms other than Two and a Half Men. Did I do that? That is from... um, What is it? Family something. Did I do that? People are saying Family Matters. Family Matters? Yeah. All right, brilliant. Okay, I'm going to look up the was I supposed to know guy just before I finish reading out this review. <laughs> I don't think that's right, Schmidt. I didn't do it by part. Because I want to... S- <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not Did finding I anything, guys, that? for the was I supposed to know guy. Oh, well. But Jordan does seem like the kind of person to be like, how was I supposed to know? I have uh, said that sentence. Would you rather be abducted by aliens or sent 10 years back in time? Is that uh, for us to answer? I'm going to say abducted years. by aliens. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, that's that's, that's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that's worse than the Paris 3. <laughs> you would rather... Okay, think no, of no, no, no. how I've you would treat... Okay, so now you're the alien and you have abducted a ladybird and what are you going to do to it? Okay, counterpoint. What... It is so good about being sent back in time. Okay, invest, you, invest invest in, in you know Bitcoin. what to invest in, you become I'm a millionaire. Okay. Boom. Well, let's let's do the alien Whereas you're probably getting then. like tortured by this alien as they do experiments no, on your I body. No, I don't think so. Oh, oh, perfect. I think aliens either... I'll talk them out of it. <laughs> no, the aliens either kill the whole planet yeah. or they like abduct one person to the have testing. like chill times. <laughs> no, no, they're testing. Well, do they're we famously do that with animals? It doesn't say we're the first person to be abducted by aliens. Uh, you can get abducted. Every they animal we've experimented on, I bet, is not a big fan. Jordan, yeah, every let's mouse. go back in time and invest in Bitcoin. Yeah. See you there, okay, brother. here's Ooh. my questions. Are you younger? Is it like you're going back into your body 10 years ago? I'd rather so. not, but if I do, fine. No, I'm saying... I still pick that up. I, d- I don't think you do. Okay. I think you go back at this age yep. and then like Perfect. you're 10 years younger than all your friends. We'll just get new friends. I'll get new friends, yeah. And I'll be rich and I'll, I'll get easily lost. Again, of I can talk to my other humans. Okay. I can't talk to aliens. So. Uh, so you're 10 years younger. And I keep my Holly. smash knowledge? Damn. No, and Holly, you're 10 yeah, years younger. Yeah, but Holly's not there in the alien situation either. So yeah, she's not going to be able to out of it. You have to no, get an I'm, alien girl. Getting abducted by aliens isn't just an end all. You know, Could you might be. get abducted it's for a fun day out and then get sent back. <laughs> no. Why do you think they're going to be so fun There's with possibilities. You? No mouse has ever copped it in the science well, lab. Maybe I'd rather like, take the, a fun day out and then head back to the fucking The, the mouse is like up all the sides as the city leaves. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, brother. That was awesome. <laughs> Catch you on the flippy. It's going to be like that. <laughs> they're fucking getting injected with Can fucking Can I get a piece AIDS. of cheese on the way out? <laughs> Cheers, boys. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> the mouse. You're not even going to be able to understand <laughs> these aliens. You can't just speak English. English. The mouse skateboarding out, does a kickflip. <laughs> Yo! This has been the sixth day of the scientists. <laughs> I don't think it's necessarily like just doing experiments, but maybe you guys are right. Nah, I'm going back in time. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm the best. Uh, like, I haven't even thought about it, but Bitcoin seems smart. I think you can just see stuff happening as well. Like, okay, COVID's coming, so I'm going to buy a bunch of masks and sell them or like <laughs> shit like that. You know, so many things. True. I thought about it for yeah, four okay. seconds and I feel like my plan's better than <laughs> hanging out with aliens. <laughs> All right, we're going to do one more before we finish. Oh, two five stars. This one's from Temmie. Yeah. Five stars. She says... Tammy. No, Temmie. I'm assuming it's Temmie. girl, but maybe it's a... We'll just say they say. I yeah. that name. I can't think of a funny review, so I'll let Jordan finish it for me. Okay, and nice. Jordan, we got a bit of a fill-in-the-blank situation, so that's how we're going to end the podcast God today. God's sake. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> so this is like coming from... Maybe you can just read it out. Okay. Starting from oh, this Oh, no, podcast. we've seen how this goes. This, this podcast is so cool because I always come. The people that are the so funny when they always make jokes and talk about Easter Jesus Christ, that sucked. Jordan, do a better job. <laughs> Thanks for You're the review. You're telling yourself to do a better job. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that sucked. All right, thanks oh, for watching. Wow. 